The grounds of the General Lew Wallace Study Museum in Crawfordsville played host to Civil War historians from all over the Midwest. Adam Hall takes us inside camp for a look at some of the equipment used during the Civil War. Hey! When you come to, to a place like this, it makes it real. Civil War historians traveled from all over the Midwest to Crawfordsville to show what life was like during the war. This is what we enjoy doing. We spent a lot of time, we spent a lot of effort in researching a lot of this stuff. And as you can see, a lot of the time spent uh, getting the collections together. On display were guns, artillery, and communication devices, including this reproduction of a Beardsley Magneto electric telegraph. I really enjoyed looking at the signaling and seeing some of the devices there and how they were used. And it was fascinating to talk to the guys who were dealing with the artillery. For Brian Strait of West Lafayette, the artillery display served as a reminder of how horrific the Civil War was. When people went into battle and you see some of the artillery pieces that were pointed at them, you see some of the ordnance that was fired at them, you get a real sense of just what the war really meant to the soldier in the line. Members of the Ohio Valley Civil War Association helped explain items to children. They say a lot of what they teach can't be found in history books. It's really neat to put things on the ground for these kids to see that in a lot of cases like these, they'll never read about. And they'll actually pick up a piece of something that's, that's an original, that's not a reproduction. And you, you look at him and you say, you've got something there that was actually at the Battle of Gettysburg. And these kids' eyes just get big as bubbles. And it's really, that's what makes the hobby worthwhile. Reporting from Crawfordsville, Adam Hall, News Channel 18.